Hi, everyone. Dr. Elizabeth Bonet here. Dr. Liz, welcome to the Hypnotize Me podcast. Before we jump in, please note that the podcast is not mental health treatment, nor should it replace mental health treatment. If you need psychotherapy or hypnotherapy, please seek treatment from a trained professional. I do hypnosis all over the world, so please feel free to contact me through my website, drlizhypnosis.com, D-R-L-I-Z hypnosis.com. Hi everyone, Dr. Liz here, and this episode is airing in mid-March of 2020. We are right in the midst of the coronavirus worldwide pandemic and crisis. So I thought one of the best things that I could do is actually air a free hypnosis to boost your immune system so that it helps you fight off the virus, it helps you recover if you do have the virus, all of that good stuff. Now, I do want to say that this is not a substitute for doing all the good practices like washing your hands and wearing a mask if that's recommended by your doctor, anything your doctor (laughs) recommends, staying at home, social distancing, all of that stuff still has to go on. But this can also help you in a natural way, not just boost your immune system, but feel calmer and better too. I know a lot of people are anxious right now. I'm actually going to air a bonus episode, a replay of my Reduce Anxiety and Panic Attacks episode, which is really, really popular. If you want to look it up right now, though, it's episode 130, so not too long ago. And that has some helpful tips in it. But really, I would say the biggest tip I can give you right now is to try to stay present. So what happens in our minds when we begin to think of the future is that it creates anxiety, like what's going to happen and what's going to do this. And believe me, I've been there. Okay, be gentle with yourself around this. Be compassionate. Um, You know, I have my daughter's school is closed for a month, the eighth grader. And then the freshman who was studying in Italy has been evacuated uh, on March 4th. So she's been home for two weeks and she'll be home for the rest of the semester because they're finishing the classes online. So I have a full house right now and I sometimes go to anxiety, but I continue to bring myself back to the present. Today, I have enough toilet paper. Today, we have enough food. Today, we have a safe home. Today, nobody is sick. So when I check in like that, then It helps reduce the anxiety. It helps me stay present. And you know I'm a big fan of meditation too. So even if that means a minute or two minutes or five minutes, it's helpful just to tune into your breath and calm down. I'm going to post a video of a really easy way to do that. And I also have a video about the intro to this hypnosis. If you want to share that, it's going to be on my website, drlizhypnosis.com slash episode 158. So if you want to share this with anybody, they can go to my website and hear it. If they don't have a podcast player or they're not into podcasts, they can both see the video that's very brief about it. I think it's less than two minutes as well as get the free hypnosis to boost their immune system. So both of those are wonderful, right? So please feel free to share this with anyone you want to or need to. We know from all kinds of medical studies that they do about hypnosis that it can actually help boost your immune system. I consider it like a miracle really, but they know that imagery helps. They do studies on people going through cancer. They do brainwave studies and take tissue samples and all kinds of stuff where they know that using imagery in a relaxed state helps your immune system function better. So even if you don't listen to this whole thing, let's say you pause for a minute or two a day and just imagine your white blood cells moving through your body, doing all kinds of good stuff for your body, right? Even that will help you. So I encourage you to use that imagery. I think of my white blood cells as swimmers. Um, 
In the past, I've used imagery like my white blood cells are little swimmers. They're, they appear to be like cartoons in my mind. I don't know why. Little elves. I used that before. Little elves like knitting all my tissues together. Let's say when I've hurt myself or I just had surgery um, two weeks ago today. So knitting everything together, you know, helping me heal. You can picture them any way you like. Magical, not magical, doesn't matter. Okay, you can picture them as like factual, what they really look like if you like. But when you pause to do that, it actually does help your immune system. So that's just something to know. All right, I'm not going to talk too long here at the beginning. You're going to hear a gong and then the hypnosis is going to start. Please remember to listen to this when you're in a safe place, when you're not driving or operating heavy machinery. Okay, so if you're listening to this in the car, go ahead and stop it now, I would say, until you get home or wherever you're going to where you can listen to this in a very safe place, some place where you can relax. All right. I hope everyone stays safe during this pandemic and please feel free to contact me. I do tele-mental health, they call it, all over the world. I really do. We use Zoom or the telephone to help you and it works really well. It's extremely effective. So I've experienced it myself as a client and I've experienced it as a hypnotherapist that it's extremely effective even through the phone or through video. So please feel free to reach out. Oh, one more thing before I go. I am launching an online group for insomnia to help you sleep better. That is coming up in the next couple of weeks. So if you're interested in that, check my website, drlizhypnosis.com and see when it's starting and how to sign up. Okay. Now, some of this hypnosis I got from Wendy Friesen. She wrote a wonderful script. That's what we call them in hypnosis world, the practitioner world, a script for healing, and I've modified it so that we're boosting your immune system, but I did want to credit her. She has the most wonderful domain name, wendy.com. Isn't that awesome? She must have registered it forever ago, w-e-n-d-i.com. So if you want to learn more about her or work with her, please go over to her website. All right, here we go, everyone. Peace. Take a nice deep breath, and as you let it out, let go of tension or tightness in your body. Take another nice deep breath, and as you let this one out, let your body kind of begin to melt and float down and relax. And another deep breath on this third breath, as you exhale, feel everything letting go absolutely nothing for you to do but relax and then notice your breathing every breath in and out make just as soft and gentle as velvet and notice that breath so soft and gentle You can even imagine this breath having a sound or a color. If you'd like to make a sound to help your body relax, feel free to do that now. And if you're imagining a color, let that color begin to have a wonderful softness, rich and beautiful. And even a wonderful fragrance. And now let every breath that you breathe become more than just a breath in and a breath out. Let it become continuous as if the breath in naturally is a circle to the breath out and the breath out is a circle to the breath in. And as you breathe, the circle becomes comforting, relaxing, natural and takes you deeper and deeper inside of yourself letting everything else float away 
as you go deeper. No beginning and no end to that circle, just a continuous, easy, flowing round and round. And let this circle of breath relax you, comfort you, and bring you a wonderful abundance of peace. Feeling so serene now, just nothing for you to do right now, but relax and help your immune system function better. Simply by engaging in this process, simply by listening and imagining, simply by hearing. Imagine now that you could place your consciousness in the center of that circle. And as you breathe in and around and through the circle, that you're actually inside of it. Just let your mind exist inside of that circle. And know that there's the most amazing and wonderful things for you to experience inside of this. I'm going to quiet down just for a couple of moments while your subconscious mind prepares itself to help you increase your immune system function, to help you stay well or to get well and to increase your natural defenses against any viruses. Now, at the top of your head, at a space just a couple inches above your head, Imagine that floating up there is an energy of just light, pure light. Let it be kind of like a big disk of light floating above your head. Like a big, round, flat, level disk of light. And let that disk of light have a wisdom, an energy, a natural knowing to it. It has the ability to heal and to help access the wisdom of your mind and body, heart and spirit, to create a very balanced and healthy condition in your body. In a moment, we're going to allow this disc of light to slowly begin to descend down through the top of your head and to permeate through the cells of your body. It's going to travel slowly through looking for information that's creating illness or sickness or risk to poor health, disease, or even pain. And when that disc of light begins to move through your body, it'll remove and collect on it any harmful viruses, bacteria, substances, or toxins that should not be in your body. And when we do it a second time, it's going to replace your body with a condition of health. Leaving behind a condition that's optimum for health in the cells, the flow of blood, and the organs. Creating a boosted immune system. So now when I count to three, I want you to let that disc begin to slowly move down through your body. One, two, three. Feel the energy of it slowly permeating the top of your head. You may feel a vibration or warmth. Let it move slowly through your head, taking with it anything at all that's causing an imbalance any viruses, bacteria, imbalance are collected on this disc of light and it holds them there. You may actually see or experience them or notice that as the disc slowly moves down through your head, around at the level of your ears, down through your jaw area, 
more and more particles collect on that disc and let it continue moving down through the area to your neck. If you have any cells in your body that are harmful, that disc will know automatically to collect them and to sweep them out of your body. But before we continue, let's notice the condition that the disc leaves behind. Imagine this as clearer, perhaps a beautiful color even. It feels different, feels better. And the shift will continue as we continue down your body. There's a part of you that runs your immune system and this part will continue the healing process. It will continue to strengthen your healing ability and strengthen your immunity against any diseases and viruses that are out there. So you can stay well and you can stay healthy. So let that disc move down around the area now through your shoulders. It's as wide as your body and it encompasses the entire width of your body. Let it move down through your lungs, through your chest, removing anything from your lungs that's a harmful substance, virus or toxin or bacteria. Moving down around your heart, down into the organs and your abdomen, all the way through your spine, creating the most optimum condition of health in your spine all the way down, even deeper in your abdomen, going down through your belly, all the way through and around your intestines, your entire digestive system, down through the pelvis, Give that disc the highest wisdom. Give it all the power and turn everything over to that disc. Allowing it to take with it anything it needs to. And to create a beautiful health in you. Let it move down through your thighs and hamstrings. Through the legs into the kneecaps and the knees into your calves and shins all the way down to your ankles and your feet to the bottoms of your feet and the tips of your toes and now beyond your feet see it letting go and floating away from you and notice how much is collected and then let it float away further and further and further until it gets so far away that it becomes just so tiny. And then you notice that it vaporizes into little particles, into little sparkles and twinkles that float far, far away, far out into space, far away from you, your home, your planet. And now, bring another more fresh, clean, energized disc of light to the top of your head. A fresh, brand new, clean disc of light floating right there above your head. And this time, when I count to three, this one's going to go through your body. Take with it anything it may not have cleaned up the first time. But as it moves through your body, this one is going to feel better, more balanced, wonderfully energized and alive. As it moves through your body, tell your immune system to release stronger, more effective white blood cells into your bloodstream. Let these white blood cells be represented by an animated or symbolic form. And watch them stream through your bloodstream full of energy and sure of their purpose to dissolve anything unhealthy that they find. 
you like. You can even transmit messages of encouragement or direction to your immune system. Thanking it for doing the good job it's doing in the face of a challenge. Or asking it if there's anything you can do to help it or to help speed your healing. To help maintain your health. One, two, and three. Let it move down now through your body. Slowly or quickly, it can go slower at times where it's needed more, where it's got more work to do, and quicker at areas that are already very healthy and in a very balanced state. But let it move all the way down now, going down through your head and face, through your neck and throat, all the way down the body. I'll quiet down now so that you can do this work. Good. Now, just notice how easily and effortlessly that disc moved through your body. Feel the clear energy it created and then watch it float out beyond your feet, away from your home, away from your planet even, going further and further out there until it bursts into little tiny particles once again. I just float away, so tiny, floating farther and farther away. And in this moment, Feel a sense of gratefulness wash through your body, a sense of love for the body that you have and the work that it does every day to help you. Bring the highest possible gratitude to your body and for what it's capable of. Your body is creating the most optimum state of health right now. Trust your body to do this. Speak to it kindly and encourage it every day. Accept your body and allow it to heal, to be healthy and strong. In a moment, I'm going to count from five to one. And if you're listening to this and it's time for you to go to sleep, You can just simply let your mind drift off into a gentle and peaceful sleep. The number one will be a signal to do this. And during the night tonight, as you sleep, your body will become healthier and stronger in every cell, down to every molecule, healthier and stronger, better and better immune system for all of your days and nights. If you're listening to this in the daytime, the number one will be a signal to reorient, feel grounded and alert and ready to continue about the rest of your day. So before I count, once again, give your body gratitude, peaceful, deep, serene gratitude. Good. Five, four, three, two, and one.